G'day guys, welcome to Aussie Griller. Today I'm making cheese stuffed burgers. These are sure to be a hit at your next barbecue. Enjoy. All right guys, this is probably the unhealthiest meal I've ever made, but it's great for a novelty once in a while. So here I've got a half kilo of mince, beef mince, and add to this one egg, half a cup of breadcrumbs, half a finely diced onion, some salt and pepper, three tablespoons of your favorite hot sauce, and mix this together well. Now place this into the fridge for a half hour so those flavours can all come together. And once out of the fridge, just roll them into eight equal sized balls. And I've also got some cheddar cheese cut into small pieces for the insides of the burgers and large pieces for on top. So just on some baking paper, just flatten these into round burger patties. Then place a couple of small slices of cheese on top of one of the patties. Place another patty on top and then seal it well around the outside. Just like that and repeat this for both of the burgers. So now I've got a barbecue grill heated up nice and hot and I'm going to sear up those burgers. And once they're seared on both sides, I'm just going to move them to the opposite side of the barbecue so they're not over the hot coals. And place some more cheese on top. And now cook with the lid down for five to 10 minutes until that cheese melts. And in the meantime, I'm going to get a sesame seed roll and cut it into three slices just like this. And when those burgers are nearly done, I'm just going to lightly toast those rolls over the coals. Now it's time to assemble that burger. So get your bottom bun, one of the patties, some tomato, some hot sauce, the middle bun, a bit of mayo, some fresh lettuce, and the second patty. Now place on the top bun and you are done. Enjoy! Now of course you can make a single stack if you like and add any salads or sauces you like as well. Now it's not all that healthy but it tastes fantastic so give it a go. Make sure you check out my indoor cooking channel Google Plus and Facebook. The links are in the description bar along with a full list of ingredients for today's recipe. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you on Sunday.